The beginning of spring in Japan is marked by the blooming of the sakura. Nothing is quite as beautiful or fleeting as the sakura. And if you don't get out to see it when it's in bloom, you may just miss it altogether. Oh man, I love these early morning walks out here. It finally stopped raining, so I wanted to get out here and walk under all the sakura while it's still here. And boy, is it nice. Look at just falling, snowing like sakura. <laughs> you see the sakura starting to snow, you know that your chance to see it is almost gone. But for us this year, a couple of big sakura surprises were still in store, for as it got sunny, we had a very unexpected and delightful Japanese spring experience. Grandma made some eggs today, huh? Wait, this is eggs? Try it. April Fools. So does that look like egg though? I was like, what kind of egg is that? <laughs> no, Grandma's false eggs were not the surprise I was talking about, although it was a fun start to the day. Oh, yeah. look at that, boy. Save we are God. saved, huh? Next to mine. We are yes. saved. The sakura this year has really been quite phenomenal because it took so long to fully bloom, but on the hindsight of that, it's just holding on for so long, so we have lots of days with good sakura this year. Coming out to Tachikawa today. Oh, and it's a beautiful day. Another beautiful day. Woo, it's green and glorious. The flowers are where? At Tachikawa Showa Kinen Park, the real surprise awaited us, and it was most unexpected. Well, guys, this looks amazing here today, too. Wow! Pretty amazing. This is awesome. Now, Showa Kinen is great any time of the year, but we just so happened to catch the perfect spring day, so you knew that there was going to be a lot of photos taken. Okay, so today, just everything is so gorgeous, so beautiful. Look at this. And just like all directions, it looks amazing. <laughs> amazing. Got them, got them. Wow, yes, yes, yes. Anna, do you have any money? What? Okay, I'm coming. Okay, bye bye. Well, the kids survived. Survived, but. 10 minutes without oh, us. Don't hurry, we're thirsty. <laughs> All right, so let's go, I guess. <laughs> we should have brought a tent, huh? I guess. Yeah, but I would have had to carry it. Oh, no. no. Oh, no. Yeah. The Sakuras were full bloom, and you could tell that this was their grand finale, for all over you could see Sakura snow. And even though this would be the last good day to see Sakura around Tokyo, this would not be the last great display of Sakura we would see yet this spring. Here we go, gonna see the Sakura now with the canola right next to it. About the snowing sakura, huh? It's in your hair. <laughs> Look at that. I've got a sakura hairdo now. Did I get any of it out? There we go. <laughs> There's just all kinds of fun little places to explore here. Oh, here comes Becca. The day was winding down, but not before giving our car some much needed tender, loving care. Sarah, 
What is going on? What are we gonna do? We're gonna do a car wash. A car wash, our poor car, huh? Yeah. It needs, it needs to be cleaned. It's gonna get it now. And which one are we gonna do here? We're gonna do eight. Eight quarts. Oh yeah, let's get it done. All right, Sarah? So good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're getting it done, aren't we, Sarah? Yeah. Yep. It's almost time to rinse it off. What'd you get, Sarah? A font. A font? Is that a special yeah. treat for helping today? Oh, nice. And Sarah with their special drink. Ah! Oh, she needs help. She needs help. Here you go. In this season of surprises, we had another great surprise arrive, this time in the form of a simple box. <laughs> Is that how you prepare your yogurt? To... Yeah, and I drink it. I open it a little bit and I drink it. Oh, okay. It's good. You should try it too. Oh. Wait. Okay, what do we have here? We have a package. A package. Australia. Okay, it's from Life in Japan fan. This box is very taped together. Okay. Wow. Whoa. Special message to the writer kids. Hope you enjoy the little gifts from us down under. Oh, we can't wait to have you guys visit Australia one day. I want to. Oh, oh, yeah. I want to. Remember Psalm 139. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. God painted and fashioned you as his one and only masterpiece. You are unique and individually special and called to rock this life. Oh, yes. oh, yeah. This. I got a box. This is Sarah. I don't know what to say. Embroidery kit, Sarah. And what did yeah, you get, Joshua? Yes. Oh, you can sticker make sticker by number. Oh. Put these stickers on the numbers. Oh, Let's nice. Do it. Wow, those are great <laughs> gifts for you guys. Oh, this is Nate. Dark green. The band says hi. We get their latest CD. You know, a 90s kid will always be a 90s kid. Signed CDs and books are still in. <laughs> Planet Shaker CD. That is. Right, well. Oh, greater. Oh, the CD. Wow. Oh, it's signed by the. Oh, how cool is that? Oh, my gosh, there's a lot of stuff. Oh, whoa. She made those. Those are cool. <gasps> Greater things. Oh. Oh, oh and a book. Oh, I love books. Yeah. Think like a king. Oh. By Neil Smith. And signed, huh? And signed. Yeah. Oh, masks. Oh. What about a oh, yeah. Wow, that is cool. Coffee mug. Look at the oh, mommy's coffee, coffee mug. mug. <laughs> yeah, you can take it to party stretch and you can use your own. Okay, look. Oh, oh I love cool. that. I love that. <laughs> that is. But surprises come in many different forms. Something that at first seems so normal can be completely different when we see the this whole chapter. picture. But look like this. It looks. Then put it away. Everything's normal. Put it in your special box. <laughs> And just when you think we had seen all the Sakura we could possibly see this year, another opportunity opens up before us. Okay, so today was a beautiful day. It's sunny out. And we heard that the Sakura is blooming by Mount Fuji. So with mom and dad here, we're gonna head up there and see what we can see. Gonna get some good shots today. Yeah, the <laughs> Sakura against the... Against Mount Fuji is perfect. We weren't sure what we were going to get today, but boy, we got another clear day with Sakura blooming around Mount Fuji. Just perfect. That's awesome. Grandma, you're going to fill your camera up today, I huh? Am. I am. <laughs> it's a good day to it's do it. It's beautiful, and I can always take them off if I need to. That's right. <laughs> I've already got hundreds. <laughs> okay, let's walk this. Look at this. Yeah, the lanterns here. My goodness, so cool. It's a nice long corridor of Sakura, and then when you look forward, Mount Fuji. Mm -hmm. Up here around Mount Fuji, all the Sakura blooms about two weeks later than in the Tokyo area. So we get to see it down in Tokyo, and then if you wait a little bit, you can come up here and see it. But I've lived here almost 10 years, and this is the first time seeing it like this. The Mount Fuji, the Sakura, with mom and dad here, super special. Very thankful for this. There's this little fence here, but ironically, the best shot was walking up to that fence and sticking our little cell phone lens right through that. 
Mount Fuji is so iconic with the Sakura. It just makes it double iconic. Back in Tokyo, the grand finale of Sakura was underway. When mom and dad came, the Sakura was just starting to bud. And what's amazing this year is it's a month later and the last of Sakura is hanging on. We're supposed to get wind and rain and this for sure going to get knocked off now. But what an amazing Sakura year it's been. We've seen so much this year. I told mom and dad it's like we've seen three years worth of Sakura in one year. The Japanese say beauty and life is fleeting like the Sakura. It's here one day and gone the next. Sakura is a symbol of the impermanence of life and the ebb and flow of time. The death of the Sakura blossom means the beginning of something new. It is bittersweet by nature. Ancient farmers would wait for the Sakura to know when to plant. And we who live in Japan start new jobs, start new grades, and even go to new schools. Izzy, tomorrow's a big day, isn't it? What's happening tomorrow? Tomorrow I'm starting whisper. Goodness, what? You're doing second grade. Fourth grade! Dinner time with the blocks. Izzy, what do you have there? Can I see? <gasps> Are you gonna wear that tomorrow? Yeah. It's gonna go to the same school as you, dude. That's cool, huh? The saddest thing in the whole world is that the first thing. Oh. You cannot walk together. <gasps> the first day you cannot walk together. That's the saddest thing in the whole wide world right now. Then that's a pretty good life. Bye bye. What are you working on? The song. A song? Made you made up a song? Yeah. Let me see. Let's sing it together. Three, two, one. Book tickle, book tickle, book tickle, Wow. Sarah, you look so cute. For your first day of fourth grade in Joshua. Three, two, one. Yummy, 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 yummy. We came out here to take some pictures just a moment ago and when we went to take the pictures they blew so hard but the pictures turned out to be really fun because of all that wind. Oh my goodness, it's so windy! Oh my goodness! Beck and Nana are also twirling into the second year as junior high school students and we're so proud of them. No! <laughs> It's just not quite loose enough yet. It's not right. So it has that one tooth that's just no, hanging, no, 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 but it's no, not, no, is it ready? Do it. <laughs> it's not quite ready, huh? Why don't we wait just a little bit yeah. more, dude? Yeah, wait, we'll try when we get home from school. Yeah. Watching your kids off on their first day can help everyone feel a bit less anxious. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> this is the official observation point. Yeah. <laughs> Izzy's first day of school. I hope she doesn't get blown away. Whoa, hope you guys don't get blown away. Oh, look who's down there. Bye, Becca, Anna, Mama Chun. There they are. There they are. Uh, the three amigos. <laughs> Ooh, windy. Here at the grand finale of Sakura, we also celebrated Easter weekend. And just like the fleeting nature of Sakura, Jesus' life on earth was glorious and beautiful, but passed far too quickly, just as we remember on the bittersweet night of Good Friday. But that dark night did not have the final say. And just as Sakura opens the way to a new spring season of life, so the sunrise on Easter opens the way for real life to come bursting through. If you really want to talk about life in Japan, this is it. For our Easter celebration at Paz Church was bursting with energy. So today is Easter for Christians all around the world. Easter and Christmas are the two huge holidays we celebrate. Christmas because Jesus came and Easter because he died and rose again and lives forevermore. So this is a big day here. We're going to have celebration, gospel choir, kids presentations, awesome Easter message, some baptisms and lots of fun. Today is a fun day. This year we had our best Easter weekend ever. 
If you want to see it, you can certainly check it out on the Paz Church channel. But needless to say, it was the perfect end to this year's Sakura season. Or I should say, almost the perfect end. For we all know, after the Sakura, everything turns green and life bursts forth. Friends get together and life moves on. But just like the Sakura, now Grandpa and Grandma's time with us was coming to an end. And we would spend our last special moments with them. What happened yesterday, Joshua? Oh! The tooth came out. Look at that. Look at that. Nice, big, wide opening there, huh? <laughs> Somebody's playing Mario Kart over that here. It's not a kid, okay? And it's not a kid. Yeah. Who could it be? <laughs> it's Grandma. <laughs> Grandma play Mario Kart. You're pretty good. You're in second place. <laughs> yes. Could she win her first race? Do you see how good grandma's doing in Mario Kart? Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, no, nobody passed you. It was a green shell. Whoa. Grandma's cross stitching all over the course. Oh, no. Oh. Whoa. Go, use it, use it, use it, use it. She did it. Grandma did it. <laughs> and a Mario Kart legend is born. Oh, oh my. Big hugs. Big hugs time. I wish you could buy. Wow. The big <laughs> bye handshake. The tears don't come as much that way. <laughs> big squeeze. <laughs> These are the official hugs. Aww. I was gonna say, you think it'll be taller than Grandma next time? Love you. See you next year. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so the moment has come. It's always a bittersweet moment. We get to say goodbye to dad and mom. And really living overseas is one of the big things that you have to do a lot is saying goodbye and it never really gets easier. But we do know that time passes and you get to see everyone again and make more great memories. Well, mom and dad are all checked in and now we're just gonna go up to get one last picture together before they take off. So, Mom, yes. do you have a favorite part from the trip at all? Oh, well, being with the kids and you guys, that's my favorite. <laughs> I agree with Mom. Spending time with you guys, with the kids, was top of the list. But uh, the weather was great. We saw some gorgeous uh, sakuras and flowers. Uh, had some gorgeous days going out. To Mount Fuji, to Odawara Castle, and to the park. So it was amazing, an amazing trip. And I loved the watch parties for Life in Japan <laughs> and seeing a couple of those episodes just really take off. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. Big changes. And we have mom and dad here. Oh, yay. And of course, our regular crew. Yay.